Hey guys, Dexter here from Dexter's Workshop. Uh, lately, I've been playing quite a lot with the Modbus protocol, and I wanted to make uh, some kind of adapters that would put Modbus in a more modern uh, area. Um, the first adapter that I've uh, that I've written was uh, a Modbus to MQTT. So basically, you can define what uh, devices would you like to interrogate and uh, uh, what is the delay between the, uh, the interrogation and uh, uh, it will you would be able to interrogate uh, the devices and uh, the results would be published to MQTT. Um, now I wanted to have a more uh, modern approach uh, on this one so I wanted to develop a, um, a way to uh, request uh, certain information from a certain um, device via a RESTful API. So I've uh, written a little bit of a code. Uh, uh, everything is written in Python. I'm using uh, Flask to um, to actually expose the API. And at this particular moment, uh, the input registry is the only function uh, that is implemented, the only Modbus function that it's implementing. Uh, and as you can see, you can send a JSON request via via POST request, a JSON payload via a POST request with the device ID, starting registry number and uh, the number of registry that are going to be read. Um, so if I'm going to have uh, an interrogate uh, device with ID 100 starting from uh, registry 0 um, and I only need two uh, registry values then I will post the request uh, sorry <laughs> yep forgot to start the API I'm using uh, green unicorn uh, to expose the API uh, and the flask to, to write uh, everything uh, so I'm going to start the application in the server and then we are going to post the request well it's better like this because you can actually see that it's working <laughs> so uh, we have uh, the registry number of uh, 40,000 and 40,001 with their exposed values um, I can actually interrogate more registry start, starting from address 0 to address 10 and uh, the values of the registry are going to be returned in a JSON uh, structure that can easily be parsed by virtually anything at this particular moment because JSON is uh, de facto structured data or at least uh, it does have uh, quite a lot of uh, usage so basically this particular moment only the uh, the input registers are uh, um, are implemented via uh, a RESTful API but uh, I will implement uh, the, the whole, whole Modbus functions that also includes the um, functions that would allow you to write registers and uh, activate and deactivate coils etc. This is Dexter from Dexter's Workshop. Uh, I hope you enjoy this uh, small uh, video and you didn't find it too boring. Thank you guys for watching. Bye bye.